Hey guys, Vern Danke. Here we are at Pizzeria Pitos. Let's check it out. Hey, 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 Vern. Hey. All right, guys. So if you're looking for a good pizza place, this is the place to go. And the pizza was really good, so. All right, so here's where you go. Just walk in and grab a table. All right, so it's a nice, clean restaurant. Had a really high rating. And so I knew I had to check it out. I was craving some pizza. All right, so they run the oven at 280. And so this is, this is the magic. So it looks like he has some dough here waiting to rise. Oh, is that zucchini? Oh. What was you? Ah, okay. A slice of ocean, uh, the water sauce, mm. and the mozzarella cheese. Wow, nice, nice. So he puts tomato sauce on top of this. I'm not sure exactly what that translates to. So olive oil, olive oil. So here's the basic menu. That looks good, right? Let's eat. How many years have you been making pizza? How long? Oh, 1999. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Ah, just before the year 2000. <laughs> ah, right, right. Nice, nice. Cool. All right. Well, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. One thing I noticed about the ingredients here is that they're not real strong. I thought that a lot of things here would be very spicy, but it seems like they more let the natural flavor of the ingredients come out and then they lightly season things, which is good. But my taste buds, I think are used to having a lot of MSGs and a lot of salt, a lot of things put in. And I just don't see a lot of that yet here. So basically, when I've had an Italian pizza, usually there's like a lot of spice to bring kind of its own Italian flavor. But here, all of the ingredients were pretty much fresh. And the only thing that was kind of strong was the pieces of jalapeno that were the natural flavoring. I didn't really notice any other spices, but the meats were good, the salami, the pepperoni, the cheese. And it was a typical thin crust Italian style pizza. And no, for the pineapple haters, there was no pineapple on there. Even though I do like a pineapple on my pizza, it does overpower a lot of the other flavors. So it was good to try a more Italian-esque type pizza. And it was quite good. It was quite good. I do miss a really thick 
stringy cheese. And the cheese, yeah, it was, it was there. It just wasn't like really thick, thick like I like it, but that's okay. It's just a different style of pizza and it was very delicious. Now, when I decided to go out for a pizza, I looked at places that had good reviews and this had about 500 reviews with a 4.5 out of five stars. So it, it, it does really well. I'll have to try some other foods here at some other time. All right, so here we are. Just just past Tascom Square a little bit and we're gonna head back to the square. We have a couple big important hotels here. The Bosphorus Hotel. So one thing, if you're walking out on the streets, be damn careful because these people, they haul ass, they're in a hurry. I don't know why, but they do not want to wait for anything. And if they're in a crowd of people, they'll drive by as fast as they can. It's just how it is. Just another day. So look at these double-decker buses. I find that pretty cool. I never knew there were double-decker buses outside of England. So that's pretty darn cool. Nice to see. All right, so we're gonna go to Tascom Square. A lot of traffic here. If you don't like traffic, this is not your place. Lots and lots of traffic. Ah. Move it or lose it, as they say. All right, so this is Tascom Square right here. So I'm gonna try to find the park. I know there's a park around here. We'll see if we can find it. Even the dogs are happy here. Just relaxing. Say, is there a park? Park? Grass? Park? Yeah, it's park. Over there. Oh, thank you. All right, so he knew a little English. That was nice. He says the park is over here, so that's where we're gonna go. There's some pretty girls. Beautiful girls. So I'm not sure the reason for the square. I don't know much about it yet, but I'd imagine it's pretty important here because everything kind of starts and ends at the square. 